Yo, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm gonna be helping y'all with something new. And today, in NBA 2K25, today I'm gonna be showing y'all how exactly the L2 cancel. And this year, we have three different L2 cancels. So you might be confused on how to do it or what you should be doing. And that's what this video is for. I'm gonna be explaining the L2 cancel this year and how to do it. All three of them, basically. Um, at the end, I will be showing you guys my dribble moves just in case you guys are confused on why your animations aren't the same. Um, so that you guys will have my same dribble moves and then be able to do the moves that I'm doing, right? So, um, the L2 cancel, if you did it in NBA 2K24, you'll most likely be able to do it kind of this year as well. Um, but you're most likely going to get this first, like, grand, big, slower L2 cancel. There's three different L2 cancels this year. Um, unlike the one L2 cancel that you were able to do in NBA 2K24 where you were able to speed boost. Um, one of these kind of have a speed boost. The other one, the one of the animations is uh, slower and more, and, and more, yeah, just more slower. And the other one, they just give different, like, um, spacing. They give you different, like, space and animations. One's faster than the other. Um, so I'm going to explain the three different L2 cancels that are out this year. Um, so first let me explain each button you're going to be using in the L2 cancel rate. First, the most ex most important one is going to be your size of escape mods and Stephen Curry. And the L2 cancel animation I'm going to be getting it is this grand uh, like escape move right here where he brings the ball all the way back. Um, that's what it's going gonna, it's gonna to look like when I do the L2 cancel. I have that one and there's two other animations that I'm going to get. But this is the first one I'm going to show you guys how to do. So first, you're going to want to hold R2 and run in any direction that you're running to. So just practice that first. R2 and running to the right. R2 and running to the left. R2 running to the right. R2 running to the left, right? Then you're going to want to add the L2 button, right? You're going to hold R2, run into the left, and hold L2 at a point. Your, your player is going to stop like this when you're holding it too long. He's just going to stop running. Hold R2, run to the right, L2, he stops and slows down. Left, L2, he stops slowing down, right? Okay, now I'm running to the right, L2, and doing my size up escape. I'm gonna hit diagonally up left with my with my uh, right stick, okay? Run into to the uh, left, I'm going diagonally right with my light right, diagonally right up right with my right stick, right? So, boom, that's the move, that's the three, like, three buttons you're gonna need for this move. Now you just have to do the timing and one, two, right? So, I'm gonna be running to the right, holding L2, and boom, hit the escape. Once the animation happens, you let go of L2. So, I'm running to the left, holding L2 diagonally right, let go of the button, and then you're still holding R2. You're still holding the running button, right? So, boom, boom, boom. See, you're just gonna spam it back and forth, and you're gonna get this animation like, like this. Hold on. You're gonna get an animation like this, and you're able to spam that back and forth. Feel me? So you're gonna run, hold L2, flick up right, and let go of L2 when you're doing. Once the animation's starts you you're gonna want to let go of l2 and, and then when you're gonna do it again you're gonna hold hold l2 again and i keep accidentally doing the second animation one that i'm gonna be teaching you but go ahead and keep practicing that um that's the the animation that you get from flicking diagonally right okay it's the same with all these other animations as well but you're gonna be flicking differently on your on your right stick so i'm gonna be running to the left this is the second animation that you're gonna be getting that you can use i'm gonna be running to the left Hold L2, flick straight right. I'm gonna flick more straight right, and I'm gonna get. Uh, hold on, let me reset. I'm not timing it right, but I'm gonna get this like faster, uh, like sh crossover more like animation. So if I'm running to the right, let go. You kind of gotta let go with L2 a little bit quicker this year. Um, before, like, right before, it's a, it's a timing thing, it's right before the animation starts, you're gonna let go of L2, boom, boom, you see, you see how fast that is going back and forth, right, it's just, it's a timing thing, you gotta flick right, like, flick, 
do your escape on your right stick and you gotta be letting go of L2 like at the same time or right before you do that animation, right? So I'm running, hold L2, flick, let go, hold up, flick, let go, flick, let go, you feel me? Let go of L2. So I'm running to the left, flick right, let go, flick left right, let go, flick right, let go, you feel me? But when you're doing the, when you're about to do the move again, you have to hold L2 again. So it's, it's a motion of just when to know the when when you need to know when to hit l2 or not feel me but i'm running hold l2 flick you're only holding l2 when you're doing that that escape that flicking right or left on your right stick so boom boom you feel me that second animation is that faster one um if i get the timer right boom you feel me it's more of a it's a quicker one and you you get a speed boost off of that one as well but you got a time rate and you're flicking your right stick kind of straight to the right or left. It's no longer diagonal. And you'll get this one. Boom. Boom. Feel me? That's how you do that one. So run into the left, hold L2, flick, let go. Flick, let go. Flick, let go. But you're holding R2 the entire time. And then the third animation is the in-between the leg. It's an in-between the leg one. This one you kind of flicking more uh, diagonally. Uh, diagonally down right or left kind of diagonal um, opposite ball hand feel me so if I'm running to the left diagonally right bottom right if I'm running to the right that da back uh, diagonally bottom left feel me and you'll get this in between the leg animation um, and it's pretty quick it's it's pretty quick too you don't get a speed boost but it's just a faster running animation out of it other than this explosive L2 that I was doing at the beginning Feel me uh, it's not as fast as that second animation one but it's definitely fast see that's the second animation and the one in between the legs look like this hold on once you get used to the timing you'll be able to spam it like that sometimes I'm doing like a an escape hitting like a step back but it's because you have to hit diagonally bottom left or right for me I'm kind of hitting straight down almost and it keeps doing my uh, step back but once you get used to doing it you'll be able to spam it like that feel me in between the legs boom left right so you're gonna be running in whatever direction while holding r2 when you want to do the crossover the l2 cancer you're gonna hold l2 flick your right stick diagonally left or right Depending on which ball handle you are, it's the opposite of ball handle. So if you're running left, you're going to be flicking your right stick to the right. If you're running right, you're going to be flicking your right stick to the left. And then right as you're doing that, right as you're flicking your right stick, your leg going L2. If you want to do it again, you hold L2 and flick again. That's it. It's pretty simple, feel me? Right before, right before I do that cross, I'm holding L2 and letting go before the animation starts. So boom, let go, boom, let go, you feel me? It's as easy as that. Um, if you guys need me to do another video showing my controller, I will be able to do that. Just let me know down in the comment section if anybody has any questions as well. Yo, put your questions down in the comment section. I'll be able to answer your questions. You feel me? With all that being said, oh, hold on. Let me show y'all my dribble moves so, so y'all get that as well. Just so if y'all don't got the same dribble moves and you're trying to do the move, you know what dribble moves you need on that to be able to do it. You feel me? So these are my dribble moves right here. Um, and let me know if you guys want my jump shot. So my dribbling style is Russell Westbrook. This is the fastest dribble style in the game. I got signature size of Trey Young, regular breakdown, Kyrie, Kyrie, escape, Stephen Curry, like I said. Combo, Stephen Curry, my crossover is Lonzo. Behind the back is Trey Young, my spin is pro. My hesitation is Darius Garland, and my step back is Zach Levine. To me if those are the dribble moves that I got on go ahead and get to the uh, the Brickley's gym so you can practice doing your dribble moves let me know if you guys got questions down in the comment section and I'll be able to help y'all without that being said 